here on uh, day four. It's already uh, not too bad. The sun was just out. It looks like it's starting to rain again, but we're supposed to have sun for the next couple days. Um, last night was really good. We had a lot of people come, a lot of donations stop by, and our numbers were growing. We had three extra campers here, two extra tents, and that makes a huge visual impact. Try and change something, if not all at once, maybe a little bit of time. <laughs> I saw life within Canada and I saw life within the world. Rock and roll. Because it's so unfair the way the healthcare is set up, it's going more towards the state's views, and uh, I think everybody deserves a, a, an opportunity to have an education without going in the hole a hundred grand. We are the 99%. Come join us. We took them all to Zuri Capital Stake Exterminated Mall. This barbarian. They are all Zuri Multi Trillionaire. So they are billions of dollars, this barbarian. You know. Environmental, <laughs> political, or economic, it all comes down to corporate greed and their political lackeys. Yep. And these yeah. are the corporations, only a handful. Uh, can't find an apartment to actually live and that I can afford, and even if I like do have a job, that I'm still there's people are still having hard times with their living expenses and stuff. It's important just because everyone should have a say of what society should should be. So it is night five and as you can hear behind me we got some drummers out tonight and we got lots more faces coming every couple minutes so it's great. We're seeing lots of support, lots of people stopping by asking questions. People are pulling over from the street and asking what's going on and we uh, educate them a little bit and then they're coming back with friends, things like that. People keep coming with snacks and other things so our numbers are growing. We're still here after five days camping outside and not the best weather. Last night and the night before weren't too bad, but it has been getting better and more, more and more people are coming and uh, it's great to not be sleeping alone anymore. So cold, but somebody, you, these guys slept under a tarp last night, but tonight somebody gave them a tent. How do you feel about that? I feel great, man. Watch everything. Yeah. Even though we put lots on reserve and we put crown, you know, we can't even access that. Today, the Ontario government and other governments are giving that out to their employees, their friends and family. They're leasing lakes, they're leasing big tracts of land to them that are under crown jurisdiction. You can't own in, the lake. In, in we do join arms, stand strong next to one another out here. We're kind of scattered, but uh, we're still here. Uh, 
our government, every government is a terrorist organization. Look what they did in Libya, turned everything around. The Libyan fellow Gaddafi, he was taking care of his people, really. Uh, he may have had some kind of totalitarian ideas, but, but really, if you look in his green book and what he's saying, direct democracy, that's what he was going for. Because we can't eat money. I just think it's very important that we show that we're aware and that people who realize that this world is becoming somewhat more inequitable and somewhat more unjust, that they come out and show their solidarity and get more information and support the people that are demonstrating. Tomorrow at noon, we're going to have a general assembly here. We're going to set everything up so that everybody gets to share their input so we can actually have a from the grassroots movement. We have everybody included in the discussion and from there we'll try and find solutions from what all the issues are and just try to find some sort of consensus on what the general population is feeling.